Third defender coming at him. Look opposite for the three-point shooter. BYU, the name that is missing here is Yoli Childs as Jake Toulson. Basketball, but they're also going to give a lot of help and they're going to rotate quickly away from the basketball. Toulson, the step back, and he knocks it down. From the basket, he really had nothing. He couldn't do anything with it if he caught the ball down the short baseline. Faison usually makes very good decisions. Seller or the Hokie House? I'll be at Fleetwoods tonight. In Blacksburg? No, here in Lahaina. Sellius inside is bumped. He'll go to the line. Toulson against the freshman Caleb Mills. The, bomb go the bounce. Sellius! Oh, pretty tight. <laughs> <laughs> the games. <laughs> we don't want that. Jake Toulson, the grad transfer from Utah. Guys on this floor right now. Backboards, and that was the key on the second opportunity. Toulson from the corner. Big Number response. Eight. Mike Stonebreaker. That's a good name. That's a, a great back. name for a football player. You can play high, low, and dump it down to Azubuki. Colby Lee, number 40 with the ball. The big man for BYU. Off to Toulson, who buries the long jumper. Good players, but they're not complementary of one another when they're playing together. That is, you know, when you got a, a big guy at the high post that's not able to either drive it or uh, make a shot, it, it makes it really difficult. Well, talk about difficult. How much work? Toulson to the elbow, no further than that. Shot clock at six. Toulson will have to make a play. Baseline drive, fadeaway jumper, he got it. Toulson draws a crowd. Lee, good deep position over McCormick, and this time he can get it out of Toulson's. <laughs> As Virginia Tech's horn. There, I can read these. T.J. Right, Haas, Alex Barcelo, Jake Toulson, Dalton Nixon, and Colby Lee. You got off easy with the pronunciations <laughs> on those guys. <laughs> I've got a pronunciation. Human being. And to say that this guy is guilty of infractions against human decency and humanity. There's Alex Barcelo. I have not. No, I have not. Well, so Don Henley, a graduate of Stephen F. Austin, he was singing all the beautiful music. Danny Casper, who built that program, I was talking to him on the phone last night after the big victory. Beautiful pass, Jake Toulson. And Colby Lee, third place game. What's the greatest third place game you've ever seen? This one, Virginia Tech has hit six oh, in a row. There God. is Toulson from outside. The 65 uh, Final Four. It's oh, amazing that they had consolation games in the Final Four way back. He's just a freshman. Just watch how he moves so fluidly on the court. It was a fall away from 15. From this Somebody man, Jake Toulson. Nolly both. You can learn how to play basketball. Deep three, Hawes. Yeah. Yeah. Stumbling is Nixon. They double the ball here. Toulson, who's just. Nixon stumbling, gathering his feet, and then spinning. They're just shorthanded when you put that second. Mom. Oh my gosh. It all rolls into one. P.J. Horn's basket gives Tech a five-point lead inside a minute to go here in the first half. Virginia Tech's defense has been superb here. Here's Toulson, knocks down the three, nine, three. He's lost weight from when he first got there. He was uh, confused about what it took to become a big-time player. Toulson backing down to Chris Smith. both. You can learn how to play basketball. Deep three it was just confusion as to what was happening. He didn't think he was coming back. Dave Rose we resigned, retired. That double team and that forces the rotation from the Hokies. They're just shorthanded when you put that on the squad. Here's Ali. No good on the three. Salius with the rebound. everywhere. Timing, position, skill. Let it fly. Toulson. Brings another one. And I love talking basketball with him and life as well. He knows he's got his work cut out for him, but he's got Deshaun Nix coming next year, the number one point guard in all the land. Oh, tease him, Toulson. Now, Yoli Child, who has to sit the first nine games because of the NCAA suspension. But when he comes back, BYU is going to be a force in the WCC. Yeah, but you know, you're playing against Gonzaga and St. Mary's, and that's the challenge for Mark. Bigger, they're stronger, they're deeper, they've got more players. Make it a faster game, please. It's five minutes ago. Foul was on Toulson is first. And uh, so the Lakers, Lakers, no. Lakers won again. Look, That's nine straight wins. Oh, 
There's Toulson trying to get the switch. I would get it. To just get the hope use it might be but good defense by Jalen Hill. Pause. Yeah. <laughs> 13 in a row for to get up early. We gotta be back here in yeah, 10 I'm, hours. I'm sleeping in the parking lot. <laughs> Under the palm trees, the moon is gonna come out. Here's West Toulson. Maui, that beautiful pass. And Hawes finishes with two on the shot clock. Ood and Aw to play. Well, they're still, I mean, they're 8 of 16, so it's. Okay, there's a ton of time left. But Marcelo trying to answer, to, uh, does. And imitate to mimic. Basketball. Playing Steve's shadow here <laughs> in this, this building. Although Steve was not the most outstanding player. Look at Toulson there. Another three point chance foul by Hawkes. It's a 14 to 2 run. Oh, the Jayhawks as you watch the, the finish here by Toulson in the foul. Kansas is better than UCLA. Toulson here. Watch uh, watch Toulson here. Yeah. Right side of your screen. Yeah, the right foot right to the eye of. How about he didn't Mike do Cy that on purpose? How did about he? the crew chiefs? We we saw Mike Cyphers turn this game, and then you Ouch. see Vern Harris here get kicked in the face, but Vern just shakes it off. Just forget <laughs> it. It's a broadcaster jinx, Rich. Oh, for we five. both know better. To open. There's your first three. Marcelo. Shot clock did not reset. Toulson against Hobbs. And he gets one to drop. Toulson. Lee calling for it. Back to Toulson. Shot clock down. Toulson enters, kicks, and Harding. And that's a nice. Marcelo pushing tempo. And you look for Toulson and Haas to get on track, possibly from three. There's Toulson, bang, just like off where he's got space and he can use his quickness. Toulson off the screen, finds Nixon for the layup. Terrific. Near the end of December. Toulson off of a pick. High screen comes for him, splits the D, down the lane. Shot blocked, but he's fouled. Then went to Utah Valley. Mark this down on your timesheet. Toulson trying to get some space, does, and hits the jumper. That's kind of nice. The nice cut, Hobbs the find. Jake Toulson. Celius. Got it. Wow. Paint that nail area. Alston did with absolutely no pressure. Easy flash, catch, and finish. Toulson backing in on Jessup. Spins and scores. He missed these first nine games, the child is out. If you were wondering when R.J. Williams would come off the bench with four fouls, he's in now, and he's guarding Toulson. Toulson going to get a lot of room in low. He does, and he takes advantage of it. Toulson has the experience as well. Uh-oh. Jessup against Harding. And he missed it. Nixon with the rebound. How is that not a foul, though? Looked to me as if he created the contact from Harding. Under two minutes. You see the drop for BYU. Toulson. Gets fouled, and it's Williams. And Seven rebounds. Toulson's free. He's a top 20 team. Toulson and Jessup banging in the blocks. Toulson jump hook. How sweet is that? This year, one of those was Lindsey Drew, who redshirted last year. So really, it's Jazz Johnson and Nizre Zuzwa, the two returners for the Wolfpack. A three-pointer in the corner. Serves us right for highlighting their hot shooting abilities. Toulson, the former WAC Player of the Year, followed his coach Mark Pope from UVU. Down the road to here at BYU, and he trains the... How long did it take to get the wonton soup? And then no, it came. Nobody and, orders the wonton soup. And the spoon was dirty. I had to send back the spoon. My spoon had a sticker on it. Well, it was an overall not ideal. <laughs> Toulson, that's ideal. And he's got some words. Three and then the block from Childs on the other end. Toulson the run out. He's got numbers. Harding. Easy blow by of Jazz Johnson who wanted. 
Mark Pope has got to... We're like, oh, yeah, it's going to be a high-scoring affair. These teams are going to... Nevada coming off a game where they scored 100 points. BYU in their last two games averaging 92. This is a test of will for both these coaches now. They're going to go back in the locker room here at halftime. I mean, a lot of breaks. Whew. A lot of breaks Goodness. for both teams. But you're going to go back in the locker room, and both coaches are going to say, hey, you know, we didn't play our best, but, you know, we're okay. There's no need to panic. And you want to see, for Steve Alford, do you have the resiliency and the toughness on the road to respond the way you have to in the second half? And for Mark Pope, got to find a way to get Yoli Childs to score. Step back, Toulson for three. He has been a bright spot. He's been left where he is right now with a little hesitation. Eight on the shot clock, 15 on the game clock. Hawes, he's got 11, finds Toulson, curls, dump off inside, Colby Lee. How about that? It's a friendly bounce from the rim. Situation where it's a catch and immediately turn and finish off in, in the paint. I would, I would be really surprised if he doesn't get a look here on this first possession. I think basketball. for Mark Pope, he wants to see him get there. Start the second half. Hawes on the curl. Kick out. Toulson wide open again. <laughs> Largest lead of the game at 31. Toulson again. 